Hello children, welcome to AIMS India's online classes. So first before going into today's topic, let us do some exercises. Find the number which is 1 lakh less than 8 lakh 88,888. If you remember children, we have done same problems in addition, right? Where we have done a number which is more than something. So here they are asking us to find a number which is 1 lakh less than 8 lakh 88,888. Now how do we do that? Less than means what? We need to subtract, yes? Here 8 lakhs is the bigger number. So we'll write it first. Subtract 1 lakh from it. What will our answer be? Here all are zeros, right? So 8 minus 0 all become 8 only. 8 minus 0, 8. 8 minus 0, 8. 8 minus 0, 8. Now lastly, 8 minus 1 becomes 7. So, the answer is 7,88,888. It is 1 lakh less than 88,800. Sorry, 8 lakh 88,888. Clear children? Now moving on to question number 2. So here the numbers are wrong. Don't mind. Yes. So, 2 lakh 11,000 less than 7,73,214. Again, write the bigger number first, then subtract the smaller number, which is what? Which is our subtrahend. Now, 4 minus 0, 4, 1 minus 0, 1, 2 minus 0, 2, 3 minus 1, 2, 7 minus 1, 6, and 7 minus 2, 5. Yes, children, 5 lakh 62,214 is our answer here. Now, 9,99,999 less than 9,99,999. See, both the numbers are same. Suppose if you take two numbers, say 5 minus 5, what will the answer be? Come on children, 5 minus 5 becomes what? 0. Yes, in the same way. 15 minus 15 becomes what? Again, 5 minus 5, 0. 1 minus 1, 0. So, when we are subtracting the same number, yes, when the both uh, minuend and subtrahend are the same number, then the difference is 0. In the same way, we are subtracting 9,99,999 from itself. Yes, we are subtracting a number from itself. Then what is the answer? 0. Yes, the answer is 0. Now coming to the last question, number D. 1,50,000 less than 2,20,000. Now again, you remember oral addition, right? In the same mental addition, in the same way, mental subtraction also can be done here. Now here we are having four zeros, right? Let me write here two lakh twenty thousand, one lakh fifty thousand. Yes, when we subtract, we are having four zeros same. So I'll write four zeros in the answer directly. Now what are we left with? We are left with only twenty-two minus fifteen. Now, 2 minus 5 is not possible. So, what will it become? We will borrow 1 from 2 and 2 becomes 12. As we have borrowed 1 from 2, yes, 2 becomes 1. 2 minus 1, 1. Yes, children? Now, 12 minus 5 is 7. 1 minus 1 is 0. So, how much is the answer here? 7. And after 7? These four zeros, yes, so the answer becomes 70,000. 70,000 is 150,000 less than 220,000. Clear? Now moving on. Find the missing number. Yes, we have done. We have learnt about this finding the missing number in the previous video, right? If you have not watched it, please watch it, okay? Now in this, we are having... A larger number minus dash gives us the difference. You remember right children? When larger number and the difference are given, what do we do? We subtract them both. Yes, we always subtract from the larger number. So, we subtract the difference from the larger number. 1,66,528 minus 1,55,528. Now, 2 minus 2, 0, 8 minus 8, 0, 5 minus 5, 0, 6 minus 5, 1, 6 minus 5, 1, 1 minus 1, 0. So, what answer did we get? We got 11,000. Yes? 
eleven thousand is our answer. One lakh sixty six thousand five hundred and twenty eight minus eleven thousand is equals to one lakh fifty five thousand five hundred and twenty eight. Now moving on to question number two. One lakh ten thousand minus dash is equals to nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine. Again, this is our larger number and this is our difference. This is the minimum and this is our difference. What do we do with the larger number? We subtract one lakh ten thousand minus sorry one lakh ten thousand minus nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine. See how do you know how to borrow borrow in terms in cases of zero right yes so this zero becomes one this becomes nine and this becomes nine nine and finally it becomes zero here now ten minus nine one nine minus nine zero nine minus nine zero nine minus nine zero now zero here as it is and one so nine nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine What is the answer here? One lakh one. One lakh one. One lakh ten thousand minus one lakh one is equals to nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine. Clear, children? Yes. Now moving on to the question number three. One lakh ten thousand minus nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine. Just now we have done right. It is the same thing. One lakh ten thousand minus nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine. Yes, this becomes ten, and all the zeros become nine, and this becomes zero. Ten minus nine one nine minus nine zero 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 and one. The same answer here. One lakh one one lakh one is our answer. Yes. Now coming to the last question. Dash minus two lakh twenty five thousand five hundred is equals to five hundred. See, larger minus smaller is equals to difference. So here, what are they giving? Dash minus two lakh twenty five thousand five hundred is equals to five hundred. We are having the smaller number and the difference. What do we do? We add. Very good. We add two lakh twenty five thousand five hundred plus. Five hundred. It is very important to write the numbers in their correct place values. Now zero plus zero zero again. Five plus five ten one carried. Five plus one six two two as it is. What is the answer? Two lakh twenty six thousand. Two lakh twenty six thousand minus two lakh twenty five thousand five hundred is equals to five hundred. Clear, children? We found out the missing number. How did we find out? When larger number and difference are given, we subtract them to find the smaller number. And when smaller number and difference are given, we add them to find out the larger number. Clear? Moving on, let us learn about today's topic: properties of subtraction. We've learnt about properties of addition, right? Yes, in the same way, let us learn about properties of subtraction. Property number one: order of numbers. The order of the numbers to be subtracted and the number from which it is to be subtracted is important. If you remember from the addition lesson, children, uh, the order of the numbers. What did we learn? See, five plus two becomes what? Seven. Even though if you change the order, that is, write two first and five second. Two plus five will also give us the same answer that is seven. Yeah, but in case of subtraction, five minus two is what? Three. Yes. What if what happens if I change the order? Two minus five is this possible, children? Two is the smaller number and five is the larger number. We cannot subtract the larger number from the smaller number. So what are they saying? The order of the numbers to be subtracted. And the number from which it is to be subtracted is important. Yes, the number from which it is to be subtracted. We always subtract a number from the larger number. We have so yes, children. This is the order, right? Larger minus smaller. We cannot change the order here. Here they are given two examples. See, 
सिक्सटी फोर माइनस टेन इज फिफ्टी फोर ओके लार्जर माइनस स्मॉलर बट वॉट हैपन्स इफ आई चेंज द ऑर्डर टेन माइनस सिक्सटी फोर इज इक्वल टू वॉट वी कैन नॉट आंसर बिकॉज हियर टेन इज द स्मॉलर नंबर एंड सिक्सटी फोर इज द लार्जर नंबर इट इज नॉट पॉजिबल टू सप्रैक्ट दीज टू सो द ऑर्डर ऑफ द नंबर्स इज इम्पॉर्टेंट इन सप्रैक्शन सिमिलरली थ्री हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी माइनस हंड्रेड यस लार्जर माइनस स्मॉलर इज इक्वल टू टू फिफ्टी दैट इज द डिफरेंस बट वॉट इफ आई चेंज द ऑर्डर हंड्रेड माइनस थ्री फिफ्टी इज इक्वल टू वॉट वी डोंट नो एंड वी कैन नॉट से हियर वाई बिकॉज हियर वी आर नॉट फॉलोइंग द ऑर्डर हियर इट इज स्मॉलर माइनस लार्जर नंबर विच इज नॉट पॉजिबल टू फाइंड आउट क्लियर नो क्वेश्चन नंबर टू प्रॉपर्टी नंबर टू सब्ट्रैक्टिंग जीरो इफ यू सब्ट्रैक्ट जीरो फ्रॉम एनी नंबर द आंसर इज द नंबर इट सेल्फ यस इफ यू रिमेंबर फ्रॉम एडिशन इफ वी एड जीरो टू एनी नंबर वॉट विल बी द आंसर द आंसर विल बी द नंबर इट सेल्फ यस इन द सेम वे वेन वी सब्ट्रैक्ट जीरो फ्रॉम एनी नंबर द आंसर विल बी द नंबर इट सेल्फ यस चिल्ड्रेन दैट इज फाइव माइनस फाइव इज इक्वल टू फाइव ओनली हंड्रेड माइनस जीरो इज इक्वल टू हंड्रेड ओनली नाइन लैख ट्वेंटी सेवन थाउजेंड इज माइनस जीरो इज ऑल्सो इक्वल टू नाइन लैख ट्वेंटी सेवन थाउजेंड ओनली यस सो इफ यू सप्रैक्ट जीरो फ्रॉम एनी नंबर द आंसर इज द नंबर इट सेल्फ लेट एस लुक एट सम एग्जाम्पल्स हियर सिक्स माइनस जीरो इज इक्वल्स टू सिक्स यस नाइंटी टू माइनस जीरो इज इक्वल्स टू अगेन नाइंटी टू एट एट हंड्रेड एंड सेवेंटी सिक्स माइनस जीरो इज इक्वल्स टू एट हंड्रेड एंड सेवेंटी सिक्स ओनली एंड इन द सेम वे फोर थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी फोर माइनस जीरो इज इक्वल्स टू फोर थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी फोर ओनली द सेम नंबर यस मूविंग ऑन टू द प्रॉपर्टी नंबर थ्री सब्ट्रैक्टिंग वन If we subtract one from any number, we get the predecessor of the number. That is the number just before it. Now, if you remember from the addition, we have five. And what happens if we add one? Five plus one is equals to six. Now, what is this six? When we are writing the numbers one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, six comes just after the given number five. so it becomes the pred successor yes it becomes the successor in the same way when we subtract one from the given number 5 minus 1 is equal to what 4 yes now if you look at the order of the numbers 4 comes when 4 comes just before the given number 5 and it is also called as what it is called as the predecessor of the number yes so what happens when we subtract one if we subtract one from any number we get the predecessor of the number that is the number just before it see look at the examples here 25 minus 1 is equal to 24 yes when we are writing the numbers we say 23 24 and 25 24 comes just before 25 And twenty four is what the predecessor. Yes, what is the predecessor? Predecessor is the number that comes just before a given number, right? We find it out by subtracting one. Now thirty one minus one is equals to thirty. Yes, again we write thirty thirty one. So thirty comes before thirty one. The same way six hundred and twelve minus one is equals to six hundred and eleven, and Nine thousand eight hundred and sixty-seven minus one is equals to nine thousand eight hundred and sixty-six. So these numbers, that is the difference here we got, are the predecessors. Yes. Now property number four, subtracting a number from itself. If a number is subtracted from itself, the answer we get is zero. Yes. Just now we have discussed right in the previous slide. That when we subtract a number from itself, suppose I gave you had, I gave you five chocolates and then I took away all of the five chocolates. Yes, I gave you five and then I took away all of the five chocolates. Now how many will you be remaining with? 
you will be remaining with zero chocolates you have nothing now yes so here what are they saying when we subtract a number from itself the answer is zero yes just like 5 minus 5 is equal to zero this is our property number four examples one 1981 minus 1981 is equal to zero is the same number subtracted from itself now 229208 minus 29208 again the number is subtracted from itself the answer is 0 3542 minus 3542 yes children the number subtracted from itself the answer is 0 Yes, children, now moving on to the property number 5. Subtracting 10, 100, etc. While subtracting 10, 100, 1000, etc. from a number, notice the change that comes about in the digits in the appropriate places only. In what places? In appropriate places only. Now, what he wants to say is, from a given number, I am subtracting 100. I am subtracting 100. So, if you look at the number here and the difference here, the only change that has come is in the hundreds place only. We are uh, subtracting minus, we are subtracting 100. So the change is also in the hundreds place only. Yes, we, it is 100. So 4 minus 1 that is equals to 3 hundreds here. Clear? And when we move on to the, thou, in, to the second example where 1000 is subtracted from 83,452. See, the change is in the thousands place only. Yes, so 3 minus 1 is equals to 2. Remember the addition addition property children adding 10, 100 and 1000 to a number. Suppose 8,354 plus 10. What will the answer be? What did we learn when we add 10 to a number? Only the digit in tens place changes. Yes, the remaining digits are written as it is. 8, 3, 4 and what happens to the digit in tens place? We add 1 to it. Yes, here we are having 1 in tens place. So, 5 plus 1 becomes 10. In the same way, if we add 100 to a number, the play, uh, only the number in hundreds place changes. I will write the remaining numbers as it is. And here we are having 3 in hundreds place. And in the second add end, I am having 1 in the hundreds place. So, there is an addition symbol here. 3 plus 1 becomes 4. Yes, children. This 8,354 plus 100 becomes 8,454. In the same way, suppose what happens when there is a subtraction symbol. Now, 5 minus 1. Yes, 5 minus 1 here. 5 minus 1 is what? 5 minus 1 is 4. Yes. See, here we are having 10. Yes, here we are having 10. Now, we are not having any digits in hundreds and thousands place. So, these digits will be written as it is. And here we are having 0. 4 minus 0 is what? 4 only. So, again, this number is also written as it is. Now, the only number that changes is the digit in the tens place. 5 minus 1 is equals to 4. Clear, children? In the same way, 8354 minus 100. See, when we are reading this number aloud, how do we read it? 8,354. Yes, now, we are removing 100 from it. We are having 300s here. So, what will this become? 3 minus 1 becomes 200. So, what will our new number be? 8,000. 254 see 8254 clear children only the digit in hundreds place changes 3 minus 1 2 what happens when we subtract 200 now 3 minus 2 is 1 so it becomes 8154 the remaining digits are as it is now the same thing with the thousands as well what is this again how will we read this 8000 yes we'll read it as 8354 now when i add 1000 to it 
this 8 becomes what? The next 8 plus 1 becomes 9. So, this becomes 9,300 and yes, 354. Clear children, only the digit in the thousands place is changing. Now, here we are having zeros here. 0 plus anything is equals to the number itself. So, the numbers, the remaining digits as it is, 1 in thousands place. Here we are having 8 in thousands place. So, 8 plus 1 becomes 9. In the same way, when we subtract 1 from this, 8 minus 1 becomes 7. So, 8000 becomes 7000. Clear children, when we are subtracting 10, 100, 1000 etc. Where we are having zeros like this from a number, we need to notice that the change comes about in the digits in the appropriate places only. The change comes in the digits where we are having 1. Here we are having 1 in the tens place. So, the change comes in tens place only. And here we are having 1 in the hundreds place. So, the change comes in the hundreds place only. See, here we had 4. Now, we have 3. Why? Because 4 minus 1 is 3. Now, here in thousand we are having 1 in thousands place. So, the change comes in thousands place. 3 minus 1 becomes 2. We notice that when we subtract 10, 100 etc. from a number, the digit in tens, hundreds, thousands places decreases by 1. The other digits remain the same. What happens to the other digits children? They remain the same. Clear? Let us subtract few numbers and see how this works. Now fill in the blanks. 65,321 minus dash is equals to 65,321. See, we have subtracted something, but the difference is the same as the minuend. Yes, there is no change in the number. Now, what was subtracted? 0. Yes, why? Because when we subtract 0 from a number, the difference will be the number itself. Yes, the result will be the number itself. Now, coming to question number B, 76,327 minus dash is equals to 76,324. If we observe, the only change is in the ones place. Here we are having 7 minus dash is equals to 4. Yes, 7 minus dash is equals to 4 children. 7 minus 3. Yes, 7 minus 3 is equals to 4. So, 76,327 minus 3 is equals to 76,324. How did we find out? Because the only difference that has come here is in the digit in 1's place. Moving on to question number C. 48,235 minus 100 is equal to dash. Now, again, just now we have done, right? The digit... In this 100, 1 is at 100's place, remaining digits are zeros. So, the change comes only in the digit in 100's place. 2 minus 1 is what? 1. Yes, 2 minus 1 is 1. The remaining digits as it is 4, 8, 2 minus 1, 1 and 3, 5 as it is. Clear children? 48,235 minus 100 is equals to 48,135. Now, question number D. Again, similar question here. 100 less than 4,83,245. Again, here 1 is at 100's place. So, the change occurs only in the 100's place. Let us write the remaining digits as it is. 4, 8, 3. Sorry, I will write here. 100's and 100's. 4, 8, 3. Now, less than, right? They are asking less than means we need to subtract. 2 minus 1 is 1 and 4, 5 as it is. Clear? Only the change has here has occurred in the digit in hundreds place. Coming to question number E. 67,385 minus dash is equal to 0. Now, we have learnt about a property, right children? What was that? Subtracting a number from itself. If a number is subtracted from itself, the answer we get is 0. Yes, 
when a number is subtracted from itself the answer will be 0 now here the answer is 0 so what should be subtracted the same number 67385 when the number is subtracted from itself the answer becomes 0 now moving on to question number f 97080 is equals to 97180 minus dash see here i am having 1 but here in the answer i have 0 yes we am having 1 here and i am having 0 1 minus dash is equal to 0 i was having 100 here minus dash is equals to 0 now children Again, the answer we got here is 0. Now, what number was subtracted from it? The same number, yes. The 1 is, sub when 1 is subtracted from 1, the answer will be 0. And can I write only 1 here? No, I cannot write only 1. If I write, if I write simply 1, what will happen? This 1 will be in the 1's place. But in the question, 1 is in the 100's place. The change has come in the 100's place. So, this 1 should be in the hundreds place. Now, what about 1's and 10's place? We will fill it with zeros. Yes, we are having 97,180. When, when we subtract 100 from it, the answer will be 97,080. Clear children? Moving on to question number G. Now, 2,32,849 is equals to dash minus 1. Now see, I am having a number minus 1 is equals to the difference. Yes, just we have found out the, uh, now here 1 is what? 1 is the smaller number. Now here the larger number is missing. To find out the larger number, what do we do? We add the small number and the difference. Yes. We add the small number and the difference to get the larger number. Now see, the difference is 1 and the large, the difference is 2,32,849. The smaller number is 1. Let us add those two. 2,32,849 plus 1. 9 plus 1, 10, 1 carried. 4 plus 1, 5, 8, 2, 3, 2. Yes, children, 2 lakhs 32,850. 2 lakhs 32,850 is our answer here. How did we find out? We have the smaller number and the difference here. We need to find out, uh, we needed to find out the larger number. Larger number is equals to what? Smaller number plus difference. And how to find out the smaller number? Smaller number is larger number minus difference. Yes, clear? Now look at here. Question number H. 1,24,563 minus dash is equals to 1,24,463. Now again you can solve this question in two ways. One is we are having the larger number and the difference. So we can subtract those two to find out the smaller number. Let us see. 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 3 minus 1, 2, 4, 4, 6, 3. Now 0, 0, 5 minus 4, 1. Now again 4 minus 4, 0, 2 minus 2, 0, 1 minus 1, 0. What is the answer here children? 100. 1,24,563 minus 100 is equals to 1,24,463. Okay. This is one method of solving it. Coming to the other method, if we carefully observe the minuend and the difference, the change has taken place only in the hundreds place. Yes. So what is the what does it mean? It means that we have subtracted hundred from it. Five minus one, five minus four is one, and as it is in hundreds place, it is one hundred. Suppose it was three hundred and sixty three. Okay. 5 minus 3 is 2, but not simply 2. Here it is 500 minus 300. So the answer is 200.
clear children yes these were the two ways of solving it now the last question i 47 4,72,891 minus dash is equals to 4,72,881 now again if we observe there are two methods of solving it we have the larger number and difference we can find out the smaller number by subtracting the difference from the larger number remember i said how to remember we always subtract from the larger number yes so when we have the larger number we subtract the difference from it 4,72,891 minus 4,72,881 what will the answer be 1 minus 1 0 9 minus 8 1 now again 8 8 0 2 minus 2 0 7 minus 7 0 4 minus 4 0 the answer is what the answer is 10 4,72,891 minus 10 is equals to 4,72,881 now again the another way of solving is if we carefully observe the minuend and the difference the change has taken place only in the tens place yes 9 minus 1 is equal 9 minus 8 is equals to 1 and as the change has taken it taken place in tens place so it is not simply 1 but it is 10 clear Nine. i hope you have understood today's class yes children i hope today's class was clear thank you for watching our video please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for receiving